Ten. The Tiger Financial News Network. TFNN Headline News Update. Good afternoon, everyone. Basil Chapman here for the three o'clock Tiger Financial News Network market update. The Dow's down 45 at 34,900. Finally, after a couple of weeks, we've been looking at this and we'll see what the close is. The day is still young. Anything can happen in the next hour. But the nine is finally under the 14 period moving average. And that's going to be important. We'll talk about that in this next hour when I do the Tom O'Brien show. We're looking at the S&P. Here we go. SPX. Eh? S&P. <clears throat> had already turned down a little while ago from the 4507 high that was made around about uh, the uh, 27th of July. Now we're looking at uh, uh, 4423, minus 14, looking very weak, getting close to some kind of support, but it hasn't been able to use support as anything magical. <clears throat> looking at the... Uh, QQQ, NDX 100 trading vehicle, uh, down two and a quarter at 364.20, uh, making low lows. It's under the 50 period exponential moving average, very weak action. Looking at the IWM, the Russell 2000, we're looking at whew, minus 155 at 186.59. What a quick give back. It's, it's really taken away all of weeks of worth of upside move. It's a 186, and it's getting closer to the 184.70, 200 period exponential moving average. Gold, and this is fascinating because gold keeps trying to rally, but it just makes lower lows and lower highs. And today's down 10 at 1926, below the 1940 left side low of early July. And we're looking at the dollar, and it's fascinating because the dollar is doing okay. It's not great. It hasn't even taken out the high of a couple of days ago. It's at 103.29, up 8 ticks. This is fascinating because that 200 period moving average is like a magnet. We'll talk about that when I get back uh, for the uh, Tom O'Brien show. Looking at crude oil, crude oil is down sharply. It's down 162. Um, now we're going to be watching to see whether that nine period moving average just crosses negative and that will say it's going from a sell signal. It hasn't got that yet. But that 200 period moving average of 77.50 could be in, in sight. So with that said, just a real quick look at the VIX index before we do the next show. Uh, VIX index is up just three ticks at 16.49. Uh, Basil Chapman will be back for the Tom O'Brien show in a couple of minutes. And it should be a very exciting close. See you in a few.